Welcome back to another Miner's Off-Season Update. I'm Scott Yearman on an unseasonably warm but very breezy afternoon here at Rent One Park. Since our last meeting, the Miners have hired a new Assistant General Manager. Billy Richards joins the Miners from the Mahoning Valley Scrappers. He'll be overseeing corporate sales for the 2010 season. Speaking of the 2010 campaign, a couple of changes have been made to next season's schedule. Opening day has been moved up one day, so the Miners will now open the season on Thursday, May 20th against the defending West Division champion River City Rascals. Also, the final three-game series of the season has also been moved up one day and is now set for August 30th through September 1st in order to avoid conflict with the first ever game at the new SIU football stadium on September 2nd. In recent weeks, three more pitchers have been added to the Miners pitching staff. Left-handed hurler Trevor Fox was an all-star as a rookie in 2009 with Sioux City in the American Association. The Miners picked him up to complete the Mike Phelps trade that sent him to Sioux City this past July. Also joining him on the staff will be hard-throwing former Rockford Riverhawk Jose Mateo and Southpaw Craig Bate, formerly of Eastern Michigan University. Well, your first chance to purchase tickets for the new season is right around the corner. Miner's holiday mini plans will go on sale the day after Thanksgiving, Friday, November 27th, at the Rent One Park General Store and online at southerninillinoisminers.com. And also coming soon, just in time for the holiday season, is the newly redesigned Miner's website. So log on often at southerninillinoisminers.com and there you'll find a new interactive calendar and seating chart, an expanded multimedia section, and of course all the latest Miner's news and updates. Earlier this month, the inaugural Coaches vs. Cancer tip-off event was held at Rent One Park and it featured SIU men's head basketball coach Chris Lowry, as well as former Salukis head coach, current Illinois head coach, Bruce Weber. Well over 200 people were in attendance for the event and for what we hope will be an annual tradition that we've started here in Southern Illinois. Well, that'll do it for today's Miners off-season update. I'm Scott Gearman. I'll catch you next time.